nothing alike. We's different. We's different. You ain't the hustling type. We's different. With King. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls of the YouTube world, CJ Rose is back in the building. Welcome back to the channel. All right, next matchup on SummerSlam 2020 was Mandy Rose versus Sonya Deville. Loser leaves WWE in a no disqualification match. Now, I'm going to be very honest with you. I wrote no notes for this match. I did not. And it's not because this match bored me. It's not because this match wasn't good. It was just... I don't know. It was just... I don't know how to explain it, but... This match was alright for what it was worth. For, for what it was worth, this match was good. I think, to me, it showed how solid and underrated Sonya Deville was. And, honestly, it also showed how much work Mandy does still need to do. Because I think... I, Mandy, if you're watching, I doubt you are. But I know you have a YouTube channel. <laughs> I know you do. Mandy, you're good, but you need a lot, but you still need a lot of work. And it's fine. You're still young in your career. It's all good. You know what I'm saying? Now, with Sonya gone, I would think that they should be able to... Mandy did win, by the way. So that's what I'm saying. She's gone. But um, I would think a light will now be shined upon you where hopefully you could build your way up to being a legit contender. And I would like that. It'd be something new. And probably out of everybody on the SmackDown roster, you're the only one to never get a shot. You actually are the only one to never get. You and Sasha are the only two to never face Bayley for the SmackDown Women's Championship. Now, I know at this point, it's going to be Bayley and Sasha at some point. But when that's over, you... You should be ready. You should be ready. Hopefully. I'm hoping. In terms of this match, in terms of this match, um, as I said, it wasn't it wasn't a bad match. It was just I don't know. I feel like it could have been the build up for this match was so great to where it is now. It was it was okay. It was a good match. It was okay. For what it was worth. I thought the way they made it seem like these two women were going to go out here and kill each other with no regret. It wasn't like that. It was close. <laughs> it was close. A couple problems I had, though. Mandy looked so stiff in some spots. I just don't. That That's what I'm thinking. That's what I'm saying. Like, she, she needs a little bit more. She seems so stiff, like. She she wasn't moving right for me. I don't, you know what I'm saying? Like she wasn't I don't know. Like that that's just me. Number one. Um number two, there was this one spot that I just don't understand and I wish somebody could help me understand. So there was a t so Mandy set up actually there's two. <laughs> We're talking about this table. This there was two spots. So Mandy Rose was having a hard time with the table. Picking up the table, setting up the table. I don't know why. <laughs> I need help with that. <laughs> number one. Number two. That table was never used to begin with. How you set up something that was never used? That table stood there the whole time, never used. For what reason? Why did you set it up to begin with? That's number one. That, that's number one. Number two, Mandy could have easily pushed the table aside and hit her with a chair, right? Instead, she, ha she has the table in front of her. And what she decides to do is slide chairs on the table. So, so she slid chairs on the table, which is weird. I, I, I never seen that. That's so weird to me. And literally, Sonya was duck ducking. So what the, so what's the purpose? It's, What's the purpose of that? Like, I don't, I don't understand it. I don't get it. But I'm just saying that kind of goes. I, I don't, I don't know. But, but yeah. Um, Sonya won. I'm sorry, Mandy won. And after that, Sonya was so distraught, which I'm understandable because Sonya's kind of crazy at this point. 
Um, so we'll see where this goes. Um, as I said, if Sonya is gone for a while, then Mandy has this opportunity to grow and become a legit contender. I think if she gets puts the work in, continues, and at least has a spotlight on her, then she definitely will be or should be the next contender for us for the SmackDown Women's Championship. I believe she should be. Because <clears throat> it makes sense. Why not? She's one of the few people that you have that actually is, you know, hasn't done anything, you know? So let's use her as the best as best as we could. Why not? I'm down with it. Cool. Alright. <clears throat> so this is match number three. Match number four on the way. Let's get it. 